Welcome to County Office, your complete guide to local government services and public records. Let's start learning. What types of injuries are covered by workers' compensation for office workers? When it comes to office workers, accidents can happen even in the safest of environments. So, what types of injuries are covered by workers' compensation for office workers? Let's find out. First and foremost, workers' compensation is designed to protect employees who suffer work-related injuries or illnesses. This includes office workers who may face various risks in their day-to-day -day tasks. One common type of injury covered by workers' compensation is repetitive strain injuries. These occur when office workers perform repetitive motions for extended periods, such as typing or using a mouse. So, if you find yourself with a case of mouse shoulder, workers' comp has got your back. Another injury covered is slips, trips, and falls. Yes, even in the office we can stumble over those pesky cables or slip on a wet floor. Workers' comp ensures that if you take a tumble while reaching for that stapler, you'll be taken care of. Now let's not forget about those pesky paper cuts. Believe it or not, even something as small as a paper cut can be covered by workers' compensation. So, next time you're battling with a stack of documents, remember that help is just a claim away. Lastly, office workers can also suffer from ergonomic injuries. These occur when our workstations aren't properly set up, leading to back pain, neck strain, and other discomforts. Workers' comp can help cover the costs of ergonomic assessments and necessary adjustments to keep us pain-free. So, whether it's a repetitive strain injury, a slip, a paper cut, or an ergonomic issue, workers' compensation has office workers covered. Remember, accidents happen, but with workers' comp, we can bounce back and keep on working. Take a look at the links in the description below to learn more. If you have any questions or want to share your thoughts, leave a comment. We're here to help. Thanks for watching our video. Be sure to like, subscribe, and leave a comment below. We'll see you in our next video.